Hi team. So in this particular hands-on lab, we will see how to install Parquet Weaver. So as you know, we have a Parquet file format, which is a compressed and it's not human readable. So which is a common requirement where we wanted to see the Parquet data. So what all columns are there, how the data, we wanted to preview the data but how we can able to do so we need some tools to do that so there is a simple tool called parquet weaver tool that we can able to install in just two minutes if you can spend we can install and we can view the uh, this particular parquet file so for that let me first to show you the parquet file if you see this is a parquet file okay so what happens if you open this particular parquet file in the notepad you can see which is a not human readable which is not a human readable so how to read this particular tool so to read this particular tool we need to basically you can see the ppt we need to follow two steps prerequisite is we need to install the dotnet runtime for the windows so this is the link for that and second thing is we need to download and open the parquet weaver dot uh, exe file so we need to download and open the parquet weaver dot exe file so for that this is the link okay so i have just copied those two links into the notepad first so let's say i'll just directly first download this exe file what will happen so can i able to just view the data without the dot net runtime we will see if you come down in this link you will see something called parquet weaver dot exe just click on this it is just a 6.3 mb it will quickly download so if you want to use the existing one we can use but i am freshly downloading the one more for you to see okay just take it some 10 to 20 seconds to install like uh, to download okay so this is downloaded way it is showing parquet viewer dot one of exe because i already downloaded earlier now you can see that file okay so if you go to downloads and uh, just based on the time if you see here parquet weaver so just seven o'clock 16 minutes we download it double click on that so it is saying windows protected your pc okay so microsoft defended no problem so i want to anyhow run anyway just run anyway. what it is saying you must install dot net um, a desktop runtime to run this particular application okay so to do this before you run this particular parquet uh, viewer.exe file so we need to install the dotnet runtime for that this is the url if you just access this particular url okay you go to this dotnet.microsoft.com so automatically tool will be downloading okay if it is not downloading automatically when you access this url you can click here to download manually okay so once you downloaded these two tools you will be able to see right those two tools okay we will see so this is the windows desktop iphone runtime iphone 7.0 double click on this to install okay so just click install yes i want to change the system properties so it will automatically install we no need to do anything much Okay, see installation was successful close it now you open the parquet viewer.exe file okay so it is opened automatically without any trouble now click on file okay click on file click open file now we have seen one of the file right if you come to the 19 so credit one underscore dial okay so click done you will be able to see this particular file which file we open now which file we open credit one underscore daily dot park if you open we are able to see the data here okay this is a tool to view the data so which is very very helpful for all the data engineers not only specific to people who are working on azure or aws or people who are working only on area for data bricks it will be useful for everybody thank you all for watching this particular video uh, so yeah that's all i request all of you to subscribe my youtube channel and uh, encourage me if you have any doubts or while you installing if you face any error please feel free to put your error messages in the comment session i'll definitely re uh, revert back to you as soon as possible and we will fix together uh, to work uh, better okay thank you thank you